Hello everybody, my name is Song, and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. It's been a while since we have played. It's a little cold up here. It's all good though, because we have completed our team. So I played some uh, over the weekend, and so, yeah, uh, introducing uh, Alpha, Garchomp, and, oh, he's asleep, <laughs> and Alpha Weird Deer, they're freaking huge. Get up, Garchomp. Look how massive they are. Like, hold on. I, for example, this is the Noble Pokemon. This is Alpha. This is Noble Weird Deer, and that's Alpha Weird Deer. Look how big he is, even compared to this. It's crazy. So we got them on our team. I think thing I worked with. And so I'm excited. I'm so excited. It, I was I was just waiting too much too long, and I was just like, I just want to play. And so we're I'm gonna we're gonna go straight over there. I already explored some of this area about you guys but we are gonna keep going i wish there would be a button we could go up this is kind of annoying Ooh, I'm kinda fighting. Level you up a little. holy flip look how big he is Drop style extra sensor it's nice to have a to have a psychic type on our team that's like i was thinking and i was like i don't know what we should add dang look how cool and majestic he looks yes. Okay, ball of mud. We'll get rid of some of our stuff later. Okay, well, now we get to see Hisuian Avalug. So you are, uh, so are you to quell Avalug as you wished in the end? The, num the strength of your feelings won out. Or maybe your own strength comes from the way you, that you walk among both people and Pokemon. Well, I suppose I'd better be get to work. Some bomb using the eternal ice. I've heard how they're made with muscles like mine. It's only a, f a moment's work. <laughs> this guy's awesome. Old freaks and sister. He's got that sweet wolf freak beard and that chest hair. I think it's chest hair. Uh, you need unrivaled dodging ability. All right, I'm going. I think I saved, right? Hopefully, I saved. Oh, flip. Oh, wait, is he gonna be? Is he the glacier? Apparently, I think in the last episode I said, "Holy, that thing is freaking huge! Oh my gosh, it's the size of a freaking mountain! Holy, it's a kaiju! It ain't no Pokemon! Oh my gosh, I was like, expecting! Holy moly! Shoot, I was not expecting that! It's ginormous! Look at it! It's freaking huge! Oh, how do I dodge that? How do I dodge that? Hey!" Oh! I'm fighting a kaiju. This is an actual kaiju battle. Oh! Oh! Ow! Flip! Uh oh! This is not good. 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 Holy flip! He looks cool. I like him. Oh! Ow! Okay. Okay. Ow! Ow! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This is gonna be a hard battle. Oh, it's freaking hyper beaming! Ice beam! Uh, I don't know who to go. Oh, yeah, Arcanine. Duh. Arcanine, where you at? Oh, back up. Oh, wait, what? Oh, burn. Aren't you fire. Ice hype? Oh! Like strong style. Is he. Is he. Uh, maybe he's ice type and rock type or ground type. Triple arrows. Hey, yeah. Nice. Come on. Better be careful though. Dang, this thing is ginormous. Holy moly! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh my gosh! Oh, it's gonna touch me. Don't touch me, please. Ah, gosh, I oh, was close. Oh, he's doing his ice beam. Oh, gosh. That's a freaking Dragon Ball Z style move right there. Holy moly. Okay, let's do uh, strong style leaf blade. Hey, yeah. Ooh, that hurt him. Oh, it's what he said. Oh, shoot, it's faster. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, ow. Ow, 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 ow. Please stop. 
Oh gosh, 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 please, 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 please have mercy, please have mercy, Lord Avalon. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh, I'm sorry to see dry. I Oh no. Oh no. I am so sorry. Sidry, no. Firehead. There we go. Come on. Come on. Come on, we can do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, he backed up. No, we're so close. Dang it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I might die. 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 Oh gosh, oh gosh. No, 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 no. Ah, don't touch me, please. I do not consent! I do not consent to this! And as I as I was the one who bound his battle. Ooh! No! 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 I refuse to redo the battle. They better have an option to. <sighs> oh, these are the annoying ones. The freaking go so fast! Holy flip! Holy flip! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh shoot! <laughs> that was close, I thought I was done. Oi! Oi! Ow! Oh no, this is the one that got me last time. Why? Yes, we got it! Last one, let's freaking go! This is freaking Kaiju Avalog over here. Yeah! Is this even a Pokemon? It's freaking huge! Oh, he has a rock type. It's kind of hard to tell. Well, maybe rock, rock ice type. Nice, level up. Freaking ginormous. Look at that. Icicle play from Avalog. Avalog just shot it from his mouth. Blah! Took the whole day to battle this, guys. How are they not cold? Garrick, sir, you don't need to look down so downcast. But seeing Almighty ever quelled and, uh, and by such a slight child, a child that fell from the very sky, is this transfer some kind of monster in disguise? He is no monster. He's the one who risked his life without a second thought in order to call or frenzy suffering nobles. Francois, Garrick cares for the Pearl Clan with all his heart and believes in Almighty Sinatosh as deeply. So he has feared more than anything that getting involved with the Diamond Clan and your galaxy and cause our people to flag in their devotion to Almighty Sino. But this, that I will change. Erida? I know your fears will change once you see I've seen Francois has much to teach us. He's shown us that we how we can overcome manner of strife as long as our Pokemon are with us. He's made me want to help Glacier and realize greater see uh, greater strength as well as see my whole uh, see my whole no, that's my what grow out there. La, 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 I can't speak. It seems you've already changed Irida. I knew you could pull that off, Francois. A is a diamond clan, Adamant. I don't see the instinct and start fighting. You code very uh, every last frenzy nobles. So that space timer is starting to close up. I don't know what. No idea. There's a little way of knowing for sure. Though the rift does seem perhaps a little smaller somehow. Let's hope, anyways. If any luck, things will settle down now. Uh, although even if that rift does start spinning out more of the structure, we should still be alright as long as we got friends. So uh, it's good to have him on our side. Know something or not? We may never regret who got it right about all married, but your pearl friend aren't bad in my book. Aww, look who's finally seen reason. <laughs> and that's called the last noble. Uh, I'm gonna pay grim old com uh, commander Kamado a visit and see if he's trying to crack a smile for us. <laughs> that's cute. Plus eight others. Sweet. Okay, let's go ahead and head down then. Jubal Life Village. Alright, Commander Kamado, we are here. Hello, sir. Each of the Pokemon numbers uh, became frenzy and now each of them has been quelled. We still have no explanation for why this calamity fell us, but I'm so glad we put it to an end. And to think peace was restored by the hand of a mysterious Riftborn helper. 
When tomorrow dawns, it will be dawn and the world restored by normal state as long as we'll be able to return to our normal lives. Go nourish yourself at the Wallflower and allow yourself to enjoy a good life. Don't forget, the server core work is not over. It does not end until our people can live here. His Siri with our favorite Pokemon around us. Yes, sir. Uh, good old table. Potato mochi. Thanks for the n nice size of most. Uh, helping a potato mochi been old chum. Oh, and if there's anything else you'd recommend, by all means, bring it out. We just eat the- all oh, this is all we eat. I mean, almost, uh, all club puts a great threat to rest. Now it's time for us to focus our server work. Though we still can't let out uh, run around wild, regular wild Pokemon, of course. And certainly my research has rather never really needed quelling, but it means bringing calm to everyone then. I suppose we do pretty everything. Yes, yeah, someone might have been under attack by some friends you know by this moment, the friends who hadn't come falling out of the sky to us. I still wonder, though, just what is its space-time rift anyway? And we'll, and we'll finally make it go. Wait, if the rift were to vanish, would that leave Francois stranded here? I guess so. <laughs> well, our little team is certainly very practiced at investigating things now. We'll look into the matter and find a solution, I have no doubt. And even if we don't, we'll always have a home here in Jubilee Village. Now then, tomorrow's soon upon us, and it will be another day hard work at the survey core. Don't forget that we've got a sun sight something less than a completed Pokedex. That's gonna take forever. That's right, we'll get it done. And Francois in the lead, uh, me, and as the valiant assistant. Assistant, come on, Akari, don't sell yourself short. You're a full fledged member of the survey core, too. Well, thanks Steph, for that, for then I guess I better eat my fill and get plenty of energy for a long day tomorrow. I would hope that in the future they give voice acting for this, because I think it would be good. Like, I, I don't mind reading it, but voice acting would help a lot. Like, Legend of Zelda, like, the voice acting helped a lot in that game. So, maybe in the next one, who knows? The flip? The cool boom. Something exploded. The flip was that? Hello? Disaster guiding now active. What the flip? There's a freaking explosion. Heck's happening. Ooh. Dialga and Palkia. That's what happened last time in the freaking Diamond and Pearl. Prince will. What? What's happening? Whoa, flip. It's probably not. Oh, it's bigger now. <clears throat> oh flip this is not good this is not good I also have a feeling that Commander Komodo has something to do with it maybe but even if not I feel like he's not going to stand by and let Pokemon he's probably just going to kill a bunch of Pokemon some sort of dreadful energy seems to point out of the rift in times another the sky has gone red I've got word from the Commander you report to his office at once. Oh, flip. Yeah, this is like my thing. Like, I think that he's gonna pull the hard choice and like, we're gonna kill some Pokemon. Hmm. This way the sky changed. It's ominous, very ominous indeed. What's, what is this about, Commander? You did call us to discuss the calling of the nobles, didn't you? That can wait. There's something more pressing concern here that must be addressed. The first strike that the light, the first strike that, that strange lightning, the one that drove Cleavor into a frenzy, it struck that night that Francois fell from the sky, did it not? It only seems natural to think that two events might be linked in some way. Oh, flip. Who are you? What are Oh, flip. What are you really, Francois? Oh, flip. A server core member? Oh, gosh. Oh, flip. Indeed, you've done all I ordered, but that is not a question who you really are. You came from the river, as did the lion. You're connected to these two frenzies, are you not? Oh, flood. Did you not think, did you think to gain our trust by quelling the frenzies you brought, yourself brought here about? Oh, flip. And you've gained our trust. What then? What is it we really have to hear? Oh, shoot. He doesn't trust us anymore. Oh, no. Hold on, Commander. There's something to suggest right inside that wronged us. Exactly. And besides, do you really think he's got the sort of fearsome power to make, in make, take to make all this happen? Let, let me ask you in turn, can you prove beyond a doubt he is free from guilt? This person, this stranger, appeared out of a rift in space-time. Who here can guarantee he has, he is who he says, who here can guarantee he is to be trusted? Oh, flip. 
but that's no one can do it. You're asking us to prove a negative. How is any supposed to prove the absence of all doubt? Come on, let's be reasonable. What is Francis supposed to do then? Is he gonna kick us out? Oh no. He will give it a chance to investigate this latest set, but not as a member of the Galactus team. He remains a suspect as long as he can clear his name. Oh fuck. There are those in the village who cannot trust a stranger like you who fell from the sky. And I'm a little ask you to leave. You are no longer welcome to the Galaxy team. Consider yourself banished from this village until you explain why these calamities keep befalling our good people. No, until you restore our world to its rightful state and prove the innocent beyond a doubt. Jeez! Is that clear, Silene? Yes, sir. Jeez, he's, he's kind of overacting. How can he be so heartless? Don't you believe in Francois? Oh, man. Do not attempt to interfere on his civilian. I would do what I must do as a commander of Galaxy. I know he's making a hard choice, but still. But I still have not forgotten your deeds, nor the un unusual skills you have displayed. That is why I've chosen you to walk out of here free rather than just clap you in chains jeez that's messed up dude like he kind of see where he's coming from he like suspects us like we did fall this out of the sky the same night that uh, you expelled from the village what why orders are orders oh man let's go oh man no i didn't even buy stuff oh man i need to buy stuff Hey, I'm not ready. Oh man. That is so, that's real bad, dude. Oh. Probably gonna stay with a diamond and pearl clan. Could anyone do such a thing? I, did, I guess we shouldn't, we should have selected this from a stranger. From, oh, come on. Oh, this kind of sucks. I know they don't trust me. It's superstitious, but they can take it from here, man. Understood. However, the decision was mine to accept this stranger as a member of the Survey Corps. It is only right that I should personally escort him to from the village into the field lands camp. I'll also see him off. As will I, naturally. I'll allow it. And I'll mark you all down as bound for the field lines for safe travels. Dang. This sucks, dude. That freaking got dark. He just is like, I'm going to expel you, banish you from this land. Uh, I do understand the superstitious, like, they trusted me a lot. But, like, dang, I did so much good and he didn't even see that. Uh, I can't believe the boss would do this. You're acting... On his own orders when you called the frenzy nobles quite more quite right moreover even if you did happen to fall asleep that hardly gives you the power to turn it red they're utterly intolerable and i might add absurdly unscientific as a man of science i f might find an illogical thinking tooth and now you must not you only cost for some more pain if you are driven out as well for defending him yeah however there are things who might of a You've been a both a diamond and pearl client. Of course, perhaps Adamant might take you in. Though I'm afraid they both already turned to their respective settlements. Perhaps you could try to find Leon first. He should be at the Grand Tree Arena. Don't die out there alone. That's in order. I was sure that you have all you need to complete the survey. The survey the commander has tasked you with. I might. Okay. In this life, you might remove admiration and abuse from others. How you choose to view is. Uh, how others choose to view you is only a choice they can make. You cannot make it for them. All that truly matters is how you hold firm to your own values. That is true. I like Saline. Shoot. What are the what of this dream I first heard shared with you on a prelude beach to complete the bulky decks? The dream simply won't be true without you. Okay, we're gonna do something up. Oh man.